Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here and watching today's video. I hope you guys are all well wherever you are in the world and whatever you're up to. I thought in today's video I would do another little styling video based on my new cream boots from Public Desire. I am in love with them. They are so cool. I really really love them and I wasn't really sure what to expect when I ordered them because of like quality wise but they are so sturdy and comfortable and they don't rub and you don't have to wear them in like for me personally if you've watched previous videos you will know I really really struggle to wear in shoes I don't know what it is my feet must just be really sensitive but it's honestly such a pain to find a pair of shoes that I don't have to wear in so these are a dream because I haven't had to do anything so I thought I would share just a few ways that I'm styling it I'm also going to leave on the screen here before I start the video just a few ways that I've styled them that I haven't shared in this video because I wanted to do some different outfits over on my Instagram and then some different outfits here so there's like lots of different ones to see and kind of gauge how I've been styling them the last few weeks and how I'm going to style them for the autumn winter months as well so without further ado let's kick start the video. So first up I'm styling for kind of more of a dressy everyday way of styling and you could easily dress this look down but I'm styling with my satin skirt here and blazer and fedora hat I just love this as quite like a city chic styled everyday look that can easily be taken into like evening wear if you wanted to wear boots in the day and then heels in the evening but I love a blazer and this is just like one of those ways that I really love styling them for kind of more of a neutral look and within this video I will do a pre-warning a lot of these outfits are very neutral I kind of like tying in colours together of looks and I kind of like styling the boots with lots of cream accessories and pieces and then like the odd pop of colour so I've kind of done that different ways throughout and then obviously at the start you would have seen a bit more of like pop of colour with the outfits over on my Instagram but just styling with the skirt and the blazer just for like an everyday chic kind of way of styling which you could easily dress down with a little like logo white tee or a plain white tee and then like a trench coat I feel like could be quite a nice way of styling with a satin skirt or a slouch coat as well but just one of those ways I'm absolutely loving styling the boots right now. Next up while we still have like a little bit of like humid weather I feel like in the UK here and sometimes autumn you can still have those really sunny days and sometimes you just want to have your legs out and then layer with like blazers or trench coats so styling here with actually one of my capsule wardrobe pieces which is a knit cardigan I've had this one for about 10 years and I love it I love having a neutral cardigan in my wardrobe it just really works with lots of like pops of color for the autumn winter months also for like spring and summer I always like chuck it on over a little dress and I always find that it works really nice with neutrals as well so styling here with a little pair of white denim shorts and then just the knit and tying in with this amazing fedora hat from H&M I love a fedora at the moment I don't know what it is I think partly when it's windy in Brighton I like the fact that my hair just doesn't go in my mouth <laughs> so I always have one on and I really love styling it like this so this is just one of those like autumnal ways of again styling of neutrals but having different kind of tones with the outfit which I would definitely start with my trench coat as well if I needed to layer on cooler days. Next up, probably one of my favourite ways to style the boots with my knit vest and white shirt and I've got little shorts on underneath as well, the same shorts as the last outfit but I love knit vests around this time of year, I think they're so comfy, I love how they feel on, I love how they make an outfit look and this is just like honestly one of my favourite ways to style the boots or any kind of high knee boots as well like my black high knee boots which is a video coming soon I style with like my white shirt and my black vest as well and I've had these again for quite a while but they keep bringing them out again H&M they always do like the new versions each season so they've always got like the more premium version each time they do them I feel like they make them better each year so definitely we'll leave links to similars down below but just a really nice like comfy way of styling them which again you can have the option when it like moves into the winter months to layer up with like your favorite coats and trench coats too. Next up for more of like an everyday way of styling just with my taupe hoodie which is actually from H&M. I feel like it might be from the men's H&M. I can't really remember but I will find it and link it down below but they come in like 17 different colors so you can always find a color that works for you and it's just super soft and snuggly and then styling with this like slouch white cream coat just to kind of work with the boots as well. I love doing like a two-toned outfit combo so I was just kind of like tying in again those neutrals but just something that's like super easy to chuck on and you can be super snug at the same time. Next up for a bit more of like a dressed 
like dressed up, I want to say. Like I feel like it's a little bit more dressy, but it still can be everyday wear depending on kind of what's your style and what works for you. But styling with this really gorgeous brown trench coat, which is from Oasis, this is just such a premium trench coat. Like even the buttons scream premium to me. They're like gold and like with a nice tortoiseshell detail, but I love the style and fit of this. I think it's a really nice tailored trench and works really great with dresses because it's not too long as well. You've kind of got that quarter length trench style, which a lot of my trenches are actually kind of down to my ankles. I mean, I'm five foot three, so it's not hard, but with this one, I like the fact that it works really nicely with dresses and also works with the boots as well because it kind of like shows off the boots a little bit too. So I went for the autumnal colors with the creams and the browns for this one. Next up, styling with a little bit more colour and styling of a skirt and a knit jumper. This look here like works with any skirt and knits so obviously tying the colours together in your own way that works for you guys but if you have any skirts that you love or shorts that you love and knit jumpers that you love it, the boots just go with everything. I feel like this is an outfit that I gravitate towards with all my high knee boots, styling with like the shorts and a blazer over my shoulders sometimes if I need the extra layer or again, like my favorite coats. So this is definitely one of the ways that I like to kind of add in a little bit of color with the neutral boots, whether it's cream or whether it's black ones as well. And then just styling with a little pink skirt and pink knit because as you guys may know, I absolutely love pinks in my wardrobe. So there's a lot of them and I love like the pinks and blues together too. Talking of pink, styling a jumper dress here with the boots. I feel like jumper dresses are a great piece as well to have in your wardrobe for the autumn winter months to style with high knee boots. I, in my black high knee boot video coming soon, you'll see a few ways I do with more neutral colored like jumper dresses. This is an old one from Zara, but I will find similar down below. And again, just styling with the pink because I love having a way of kind of adding that pop of color. And although I'm gonna say it again, I think this kind of is now relates to every single outfit in this video that you can just pick and choose to layer for the colder months with like your favorite coats. And I probably go for a neutral colored like cream slouch coat like I just shared in the last few outfits because I feel like then it kind of works with the boots nicely and then perhaps put like a crossbody bag on as well for like everyday wear and on the go and that kind of thing. Next up, I'm adding a bit more color into my autumn winter wardrobe. And this is a coat that I shared previously in my new in haul, which I'm really hoping it's coming back in stock. It did go out of stock and then it came back in stock. And now I'm hoping, I mean, I don't know, I need to check, but I will link similars down below. But I personally really, really love wearing color at the moment. And I feel like in autumn winter, it can sometimes be quite hard to find those pops of color. And I feel like this season is great because things are on trend at the moment, like the pops of green, the oranges and the navy blues. And I'm loving like seeing all the different colors come in. But I also really love the blues and the pinks. And I really love this coat. I was instantly like, oh my God, this is amazing. So I've styled a few ways over my Instagram with this coat and in my new in video, but I wanted to start here with the creams and a nice way of kind of styling those more like neutral accessories or pieces or shoes is just kind of going with a full neutral outfit and then having that main focus point of the look that kind of like stands out. So here I've done it with the blue coat. Again, another jumper dress. This one's a little bit tighter on. This is like an old Zara one that I've got, but styling it as like a neutral outfit here with the black trench. And again, kind of doing this theme of like neutral outfit underneath and then like a colored piece or a neutral piece that kind of stands out and makes the outfit and styling with like black accessories. So like the black bag, like I've done here, just to kind of have that everyday look with the boots too. And then lastly, I wanted to share an outfit that basically is like a neutral undertone outfit again, but just showing you how easy it is to kind of just pop on that pop of color piece in your wardrobe or your favorite item over your shoulders in the autumn winter months. Like I feel like when it's autumn, it's a really nice way to dress in your favorite like snuggly pieces and tailored pieces and things like that. And like I said, love pink. So I wanted to share the pink blazer with the outfit here. I've gone for this little knit cropped vest top, which is like super, super warm as well. I don't know what it is about it. It's so thick and I got it from Zara and it's just like so snuggly on. And then these are the in style Saffron Barker Scorch shorts. And my goodness, I wasn't expecting the shape and fit to be nice on me. Like sometimes I find that skorts can look a bit odd, but they are so comfortable on, they're so flattering. They're like really, really like they fit true to size. I like the fact that they've got belt loops and yeah, I've been wearing them quite a lot. So <laughs> I absolutely love them. So I wanted to share in the last outfit with you all how I'm styling them like that too. But I will also leave on the screen here 
with the knit cardigan that I also styled them like that with the cream boots the other day too but yeah that is it for the video I know there's been like a lot of tonal outfits and a lot of neutral outfits in there but for me personally they're just a few ways that I love to style them so hopefully in some way if you guys are eyeing up cream high knee boots or even just high knee boots this offers like a little bit of inspiration for pieces in your own wardrobes and my black high knee boot video will be coming very very soon I'm gonna do in that one well what I have filmed already is like my hill tiny boots and then my low like chunky platform high knee boots so that you get like best of both depending on what you've got in your wardrobes too but if there is anything you guys want to see from me then please leave a little message down below and put in a request for a styling video I'm happy to do whatever you guys want to see so just let me know and I will see you all in the next video lots of love guys Mwah. bye